Hey everyone, exploring the mindset around question number 10, which has to do with your feelings of being a bottomless pit. This question, this true or false question, relates back to a lot of the, the questions that have been there before, and it really looks at your emotional eating. So are you taking the time to look at why you do what you do? Why do I eat a certain way? What is that, what is that type of food giving me? What emotion is that, is that masking? What emotion do I not want to feel so I cover it up with food? The bottomless pit question is, is it pretty much the exact same thing? You're, you're just eating and eating and you feel like there's just so much more room and then all of a sudden you hit a, you hit a wall essentially and your, your thoughts change and you start to think, why did I do that? What am I thinking? Why, why, why? And you start to beat yourself up over that, over that. And that is, it's a sign of emotional eating. It's a sign that there's something deeper inside of you, probably related to your childhood, where you felt that food was going to protect you, that food was going to be your comfort. And that's a common theme over the course of these, these 10 questions is my childhood what was food giving me in my childhood and how is it relating to now? So take a stressful situation. As a child, you said, okay, food is comfort. This is going to solve my, solve my problems. It, it helps me to not have to feel a certain thing or a certain emotion. It protects me in a way. And now in my adult life, when I feel X, Y, Z, this is my process. This is my program. This is what is normal for me, familiar for me. So all these questions just, it comes down to awareness and really taking the time to write it out. Why do I feel this way? What is it giving me? How would my life be different if I didn't emotionally eat? How would my life be different if whatever it might be? So thanks. See you later.